make it really very simple web pages like here that I, I have it in my my my, my projects so you have the, all the, the pop-up click on click event and then you have coordinate points selections and even though you have, can go to the your object selections no it is not uh, at the point selections you have a line definition the road description name type descriptions and then so on and you have some some yeah, static data about the project the open libraries and then you have the some some graph functionality this is the mobility distribution and uh, the static data from the liberty distribution in germany and then how can you this build this uh, the, the the dynamic uh, diagram different pie diagram or chat or different or the, or the flow diagrams depending on uh, what i mean i mean here so here's the the complete pictures like you have can make a mobility from here by making your mobility checks how how the javascript works how the calculation works i will show you detail but i will continue with one of the simple example you can put it in your spatials then maybe make one trips from starting trips uh, the mobility uh, 50 maybe uh, 10 maybe 40 minutes you work and uh, maybe maybe five kilometers one trips but let, let's let's finish the how what i mean here in and the nine o'clock at the in the morning uh, you start the works to go and then it is get 10 o'clock in, in here you can make it a private car and maybe um, maybe the 80 kilometers you drive it and then in the third trips and then maybe you go back to home and uh, for the lunch uh, or something like that or half time works uh, no sorry it's 15 15 and maybe that it's a 10 and then public transport let's say 10 kilometers but i will show you detail how this the top page is built how the calculation done and then next you can see the the really output but because some values is still missing but i will show you so how can you this build uh, these graphs and then even though how can you go to this uh, graphs uh, three at least three points I believe this is okay this is the calculation i will show you and then you can the print options you can print the uh, your 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 survey calculations even though here the timestamp and then you have the who is the builders and then all things together but i will show you detailed discussion how it's it is the development need to be done and how it works so this will be the the screencast number 49s but uh, you can go to this this way and then this is the menu bar and this is the end of the, the screencast number i'm trying to continue with you today the screencast number uh, 37s so this is the functionality so you see the the all the base layers from the from the open street map base layer google maps google street maps hybrid material map all the possibilities and then you have a over layers possibility you see that the grids in the in the pictures you can see the grids pictures uh, this is one of the another you know, student projects that i did when my when i did the my, my master programs uh, in, in Karlsruhe, germany so it's a grid so it's a grid possibility you can grid it and then you have a station heights so showing height and overlay vector layers and then you have a link layers and then even though cover area measurement there is nothing there but you can go to this one so I, what i mean that the, the exact structure without the any any ui development framework and you have the possibility to draw the the pictures and then you can go this way even the line possibility you can go this way and then even though you can i think so you can uh, you can do the modification oh you can points all the possibility and then you can draw the geometry and take these coordinate points and then put it in the coordinate points into the somewhere the coordinate points is here looking seeing the coordinate points so you can do overlay maps and the scales and zooming functionalities and then you can switch on switch off and this is our and the graphs they are finally libraries and i will show you step by steps how how we build how can you start and how it's development how is structured your very simple HTML and CSS and JavaScript. Uh, JavaScript means that for this case, it open layers libraries, and this this case this is the it is the leaflet in JavaScript libraries. So, and then you can switch on, switch off the 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 Google uh, Google Maps. You see that how efficient it is works, and then hybrid maps, and then we have the 
at the, the Terrian maps and then even those satellite maps, the Google satellite maps, all the things together works. And then even though, hey, let's go to the, the our open layers, and this is the best one. And then you can see the have the pop-up possibility. I can uh, so this is the pop-up possibility. You can go. So let's see how it is. So you have the pop-up possibility. I will check it how uh, why it not pop up works. Uh, something wrong maybe the 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 clicky unclick event i will show you what is wrong in the in the, in the next when i start the development but you got the idea of what i mean the basic fundamentals uh, fundamentals issues for for this this pop up cases uh, you see the the pop up because i have the an on event so you see the you have click event on click event have the, the this is the application that I did for the for the GSM mobile communications how the the BTS towers how the how the networks provider how to distribute the networks and the, all the information for the any BTS mobile base station towers information you see the all things information you can plot it here but this is the static information there is no no extra call from the other services like from the REST services or soft services call build information. But the, in the professional life, just we did it like we call the REST service and build a really systematic um, the web applications, uh, web application with the GU and non-GU functionalities. That's what I mean, the other features. But here, that's why I try to give it to you. How can you start the, the really basic web GIS programming or web front end front end development programming how can you possibilities to learn the the different the fun plain JavaScript libraries JavaScripts and then how can you plain HTML CSS and then after that when you have a really good ideas how it is works and then you can very quickly come up with any any UI development frameworks and then UI development framework that I said it's depending which which technology stack you are uh, and if you have a you JavaScript based technology stack, then you can go JavaScript based UI frame development frameworks. And nowadays it is too popular as like React, Angular, and Vue. That's all things together. And if you have Java and Groovy based, then you can go to Rails or Time Lapse, free, free marker template, depending on what you have it. Or uh, then you have the geospatial data server, the geo server, that's geo server is running. That's I mean here, that's this functionality data that's I, I come in here. This is the geo data. The server is running. Geo server is see, see the all every functionality is there. So, on here that I try to continue this development. You have the link informations. No, there is no link even information, but it is you see that all the information, the stations, the mobile BTS stations. So. So we get the overall idea of what I mean, and then how the possibility, and then all the all the static information for the for any any analysis on any survey report. You can do also the some static graph information, and then even though we have the possibility to 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 integrate the your print functionalities. So you see the your print functionalities to print it. So it can you can analyze it. You can go to the informations, and then you can print the what you try and send it to the some clients and some officials and then they can see the detailed information how the, the your information is passing you see the every perfect the, the printing functionalities for the your applications and if, even though it, if I have a pop-up like this yes even though that's also the I think it is also works Yes, this also works. So that means if you send it to your boss or your, your company, other company, that this is our station location, this is the information, you can go to these maps and click it and it works automatically. But, but I will go to the step by step what I mean, how it works. Now I, I start the developments because for this development case, I didn't need any, any IDE like Visual Studio Code or Eclipse or TeleJ or any IDE. Just I will show you how can very simple your your local file systems and how can you store start the html csf javascript based functionalities how can you call it how can you very simple web pages to build it if you see my c drive then project ubisoft group where 
WebGIS directory and then WebGIS project open layers, Google Maps, 